Hello and welcome to RegoFix Tech Chat. My name is David McHenry. I am the engineering and technical manager here at RegoFix USA. If you followed Tech Chat or you know much about the RegoFix product, well, you've heard about PowerGrip and you've heard about how the machines work and the different offerings. You know that there are a Collet series that start at PG6 up through PG32. But what's next? What's the next size? Is it going to go smaller or is it going to go larger? Today, let's spend some time looking at it. Today, I want to introduce to you the PG48. So now we have the option of PG6 down to 0.2 millimeters all the way up to PG48 that goes to 40 millimeters or an inch and a half maximum size. So how are we going to handle putting this together? If you followed us previously, you know that PG32 requires nine tons of force, which is a significant amount of pressure. Well, PG48 tops that by quite a bit. Let's take a look at the machine in the assembly process. Before we get to the PGU48 machine, let's look at the other options you have for pressing tools in. Of course, we have the hand pump, good for PG6 up through PG25. We have the new PGS25. This is a single size PGU machine, made just in this case for the PG25. Other series are still coming out. We have the tried and true PGU9500, and we don't have it on display, but we also have the 9800 with the digital screen on it. Now, when it comes to the larger tools like PG48, well, it requires 15 tons of press. So, quite a bit larger machine. Works very, very similar to what you're already used to using. So I'm gonna take my PG48 collet. I'm gonna go ahead and put my cutting tool in. I'm gonna take my collet, put it into the tool holder. And just like every PG tool that's out there, we have this groove going around the head of the tool holder. I'm gonna put that groove onto the lip inside of this die. And I'm gonna go ahead and close the door. Now with this machine, because of its high tonnage, it does have a safety feature that you have to press the button and maintain pressure on that button during the pressing cycle. So I'm gonna go ahead and push the button. And then for this machine, about 15 tons, and it takes about 10 seconds for a cycle. So there we go, 15 tons of pressure. Now it's gonna to return to its top position. And now I can remove my tool holder. I am now ready to go into my, to my CNC machine for operation. Now, if you really paid a lot of attention, you might have noticed that all the holders I'm showing for PG48 are all based on the secure grip system for the cap going onto the tool holders. So all PG48 holders are made for heavy, heavy roughing applications, and they have threaded noses, which allows me to take my PG48 secure grip nut and secure everything together. So lock it down. It does have its own wrench profile as well. Tighten that up and I'm fully ready for a secure grip, heavy duty application PG48. Now that we've gone through the basic operation of the PG48 machine, how the tooling works, the fact that it's all secure grip based, well, I need to answer a basic question for you. The current version of the PG48 machine, it's a single size machine. So this is just for your big tooling. So PG48 only, for your smaller sizes, you'd still have to use your PGU 9500 or 9800. If you have any questions at all about the PG48 or the new PGS48 machine, please reach out to your EgoFix technical team. We are here to help.